basically just so started with um, I was doing some volunteer work for another organization and we were we, we had meals and then they gave away bread at the end and often there was bread left over so I got permission took the bread and literally drove around Palmerston North and gave it away then I heard about the concept of a free store yeah. uh, they were selling one down in Wellington and I kind of thought that sounded like a really good idea so um, yeah it basically grew from there the more food we get in the more likely it is that more people come okay. um, and part of it is like when we first opened uh, people came and they kind of looked and went oh they haven't really got anything it's not worth coming mm -hmm. whereas now when we've got more food we're actually getting more people because yeah. it's actually worth them taking the time to come down mm -hmm. um, if they came down and just got a sandwich and maybe a loaf of bread to then you know they had to weigh up whether that was worth the gas especially if they were driving or with time to walk yeah. to get down here yeah, yeah. Um, and on that same page you then weigh up well how hungry are you and how much you need it yeah. and I think the reason that it's important is what we've shown in the last um, four years is how much food there is that goes to waste at home. Literally hundreds of tons of food has been rescued through just it. And the food that we have is not um, is food that comes from bakeries, cafes, supermarkets, individuals' gardens if they've got like too much on the tree or they've planted too many or stuff like that. Yeah. And so it means that there is um, there's just so much surplus available and we're not taking it out of people's hands or anything. We're taking stuff that would go to waste. That is horrendous because there's I mean there's so many people going hungry. But there's enough food in the world to feed everyone. Yeah. It's just not distributed even though. Oh, whoa, why don't they do that here? You yeah, should exactly. see what gets wasted in these places or, or what goes off to the pig man yeah. while this kid's starving yeah. and that's quite disgusting. Oh, well, it, it, it's basically common sense. Yeah. What, what, what's, what's the point of dumping it? Why not? Hey, you know, why not? It, it's, it's going somewhere, so you might as well, I don't know, put it here, give it to the animals, yeah, yeah, instead yeah. of just throwing it away and letting it rot. And, but anything that they sort of have to throw away, it'd be yeah. massive as to sort of just, you know, they, they have no choice but to give it to yeah. them. Some people would rather see their stuff rot than, um, than give it to people like ourselves, then, you know, uh, going to a bare cupboard is just not the one, eh? I'm really amazed because uh, I'm from um, I'm from um, Hawke's Bay, Napier, oh, yeah. and I've, I've never come across um, I've never come across a place like this that actually give food away and oh, yeah. besides like food banks and that when you've got a fill out forms and whatnot. This one here is just line up, wait your turn, bang, you're in. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, amazing. You know, God bless these people in here.